nothing to hide. Yeah, I think uh, we were happy enough to at least sponsor their air tickets at this time, uh, which is not on our calendar because normally uh, Sri Lankan Rugby Union uh, functions uh, themselves on its own and the union has their own money. Uh, but I think it is a time that they're having so many tours and uh, many things to actually participate in. And I believe Sri Lankan rugby team is also very different to what it was before. The boys are quite big, they're bulkier, they, they, can, they can actually compete with uh, bigger sides. And we have the talent and the skill, uh, no doubt. So therefore, I think it's a um, super experience for these boys. And I think uh, what I would want to see is Sri Lankan rugby being the Asia's top three. When it comes to the seventh circuit, I think we can do a much bit better. And also I would like to see us doing better on the 15s, at least on the top three, and improving our rankings overall, uh, at least to get to the first 20s in rugby. Of course, of course, and I, I think I'm, I'm just planning to do another Super Sevens with uh, Dialogue, what we had last year, we couldn't have that. And I think the National Sevens, we want to do it in a different uh, concept uh, with uh, the proposal that Rugby Union has put forward. So therefore, it'll be like a Club Sevens, but there'll be more activity, there'll be more uh, carnival atmosphere, festivity. So I hope that uh, we'll be able to bring crowds. And also, uh, there's a good news for Rugby, the Sports Ministry have been trying to help certain clubs uh, to have under lights uh, to play match club matches in the evening. Therefore, we think that that would get more crowd, more mature crowd supporting rugby. So CRNFC requested, we were trying to give them some funding. We're trying to do it in one in Bogumbara as well. So floodlights will be a key in many grounds and at least in Navy Sports Club, if you can do that as well, I think we'll have about four grounds that can play under light games. So evening, the crowd will be able to come chill, have their support uh, clubs, uh, being patronized and um, have a different culture in rugby, have, have more interest and enthusiasm. I think the biggest challenge what we have for club rugby is that schools uh, leavers do not continue to play club rugby. As you all are aware, it's a very expensive sport. Uh, injuries are quite, it's a contact game, so therefore we have to protect these boys, make sure they have a future, at least bring them to a semi-professional level. So we are working on few plans. My time is quite a bit short because I took it in a, in a very... Uh, or, um, difficult times and I only hope uh, we will be able to make some changes which will continue for the future for the best interest of rugby.